Okay, hello everybody, welcome to the uh, first battle of, col uh, for, from the first battle of my narrative campaign, the colonisation of Grox Rock with Harry. Say hello, hello. Harry. So, uh, this is the battlefield, the Brit Marines will be deploying in the centre here with all the craft spaceship, and this is the army. So we have a 10-man tactical squad with a plasma gun and a flamethrower, um, a five-man veteran squad, with WYSIWYG except from the um, flamethrower, he's just a standard man. And then we've got a um, captain, power fist, artificer armour and a plasma pistol. And then we've got his um, side um, accomplice man, who's a veteran with a melter gun. And then we've got a five man sniper team, all with um, camo cloaks and sniper rifles. So then we've got the orcs. Do you want to explain, Harry, what you got? Right, we've got ten man squad of boys with shooters, more boys over there, ten commandos here that are going to kind of creep up, um, unseen obviously, three boys with power claws, so pretty powerful, one big mech with a shock attack gun, and a boss grok with a power claw and an attack spade. Okay, so let's go into deployment. Okay, so okay, so we here we have the Brit Marines all in a circle formation. And the orcs coming in on all sides. There. And then we have a big mech up in the building. So it's going to turn one. Yeah. Okay, I actually forgot to mention this, but um, Harry has done some objectives for the commander. So this is um, Buckingham Frogmorton, the in there now with the power fist. And then this is his objective. And then we have. The orc one. Even though they're not actually Imperials, they're actually against the Imperium. Nice. <laughs> okay, so turn one now. So, end of Brit Marine turn one. Um, I killed off a knob with their um, three rounds a minute, sorry, three magazines a minute rule, and also the assault. Marines did nothing, and the snipers killed off one boy. So, on to orc turn one. So, Orc turn truck, one. Truck flies in with a wrecking ball and killed one. Incinerates it. It came like a wrecking ball. Yeah. Um, shock attack gun killed tons of Marines there. Two commandos died. They tried to charge the knobs against the assault Marines. Takes a wound. Took a wound in Overwatch. And then they tried to charge the commandos and didn't do anything. So, Brit Marine turn two. A rather eventful turn, turn two for Brit Marines. We knocked out the um, knobs. With the three rounds a minute from three magazines a minute from them, and um, charged the truck, it wrecked, and then they all got out and failed the pinning check, so they're all lying down, and then they can just charge and clean up resistance. The um, snipers, they're probably going to die, but they killed off another orc, so that's okay. And then the commandos are going to come in this turn, so orcs. Ouch, <laughs> tactical squad. I don't think we do have any craters. Anyway, shock attack gun, shot. The tactical squad, and you may see there's only one man left. Epic fail, three lookout serves failed, and everyone died. Yep, everything dead. So there's only one man left, he's running away, and we need a crater. Um, yep, they shot, didn't do anything. They shot them, didn't do anything, and then they shot them, and didn't do anything. No charges. So, bit more in turn. Okay, so Brit Marine turn three. The snipers took two wounds on the um, war boss. The assault, the veterans charged the boys, which they're gone, and they consolidated over there to um, plan an ambush. Harry thinks it's a tactical withdrawal, but it's all nice. And um, he regrouped, moved back some more inches because he didn't want to get shot, and um, fired some pot shots at the war boss and didn't do anything. So, um, I, just, I said that. Orc turn. Orc turn. Um, Three. It was beautiful. Um, the orcs over there charged the scouts. Uh, one, uh, one casualty either side. They stood the ground really, really well. The um, you see the war boss is gone because um, he shot him, failed to kill, charged, failed Overwatch, and then he beat him in the assault. So that man is um, a lion. He deserves a promotion of some kind, like to a captain or something. And um, that's it then. So Brit Marine turn four. Okay, Brit Marine turn four. The um, Ve uh, veteran Marines, they um, charged the commandos and wiped them out and consolidated over to there and now they're probably get charged by them. Um, this man chilled and fired some pot shots, killing off a man. And he's he's definitely worth his points now. And we're on to up turn four and potentially the end of the game. Alright, then that's the end of the camp of the first battle of the colonization of Grox Rock. 
Um, they were charged by the Orc boys and they managed to beat them. It was very, very close actually. He's passed all his arm saves and um, they caught him in the initiative roll. And then that was, actually no, I hadn't even consolidated yet. Six inches, that doesn't mean anything. But yeah, and then we did a one, two, see if the game ended. The reason why it's four turns is because, um, to make it fair basically, because basically it was outnumbered and everything. And another turn would have wiped me out because of that shock attack gun. So um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the first battle for the colonization of Grox Rock. And I'll do a um, story time video sometime soon. Catch you next one, guys. Bye.